How's it going everybody? You got Bison here. Finally back with another player review. I've been gone for about three weeks. As you might tell in my voice, I've been sick for these last three weeks. I had strep throat for some time and I'm still a little bit shaky so I apologize for any problems in the commentary but I'm gonna try my best because it's been too long without a video. And I'm going to pick up right where I left off with reviewing the next Bundesliga goalkeeper. As you guys remember, Manuel Neuer was not that good in my opinion. I'm doing Roman Weidenfeller now. Let's see how good he is. A lot of people have enjoyed him. I'm going to give you my opinion. So here we go. So Weidenfeller was an incredible goalie last game. Very underrated, very cheap. In this game, he goes for 2,000 coins, so it's kind of the same deal. But is he that same beast that he was last year? Keep in mind so far... Goalies, which is contrary to what EA promised us, have been very mediocre this game. There haven't been a lot of goalies that have shined for me. The only one who I've really liked so far is Handanovic. I heard very good things about Vinefeller, so I decided to try him out. But bottom line, he does not live up to his stats in game and to my expectations of him, and I'm going to explain why. The main problem I found with this card was his positioning and his reflexes. My main issue that I had with his reactions on one-on-one -on -one opportunities is that they were just simply too slow. Compared to last game, it seems like he reacts a lot slower. His reflexes on one-on-one -on -one chances, he sometimes takes poor angles to the ball, and his reflexes at times can be very late. Here is a good chance right here where you see his reflexes when you leave him in net. He makes a pretty good save, one that a lot of goalies could make, but still a good save. On one-on-one -on -one chances, he does not get his body down quick enough, he doesn't throw up his hands quick enough. He allowed a lot of goals for me, mostly on one-on-one -on -one chances, and they were not impossible saves. Some were unfair for him to save, however, a lot of the time, they are saves that a goalie should make. And also, you're going to find throughout this video, his positioning can be inconsistent. He sometimes takes poor angles to the ball on one-on-one -on -one chances, I went over that, but sometimes his positioning in net is not good. He allows a surprising amount of near post shots. You see it right here. As the pass comes into the player going for goal, he does not make the adjustment quick enough and allows a rather easy near post goal. You see me going in depth as I talk about this card, but for me, he just didn't make that many saves and those are the reasons. His diving is fine, his handling is decent, not anything spectacular. However, for me, he was not that good. And I was really surprised because I've loved this card in every single year. However, in this game, it looks like he has gotten the curse that a lot of bullies have gotten so far. However, I do keep in mind that he's only 2,000 coins, he has some positives with him, and although he had a, uh, a really bad time playing for me, I can see why some other people might like him. But based on my experience, I don't like this card and I'm not going to recommend him. I'm giving this card a 7.5 out of 10 based on my experience. Guys, this was a two-part kind of video for Neuer and Weidenfeller. Stay tuned for some really good videos coming up now that I am better and able to make videos again. Thank you guys for staying with me and being patient. I appreciate it so much and love you all. Hope to see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.